So hey guys welcome back to the channel of Beat NX and I hope you all are doing really well till now we have seen a lot of AI tutorials and a lot of AI integration done into the web browsers or in specific websites or in apps and also we have seen that a lot of web browsers are releasing their own even like the AI tools such as Google has released its Google Bard and also there is this chat GPT and other AI tools like Leonardo AI but today I'm going to talk about like how we use Google Chrome Google Chrome is also becoming some sort of an AI right now I'll tell you more about it but before starting the video I just want you to know that we have an AI tools workshop if you want to attend that the link is in the description and more details are there ahead in the video and let's continue the video Hey Aditya, I'm working in this office since the last 5 years and you just recently joined and you have a salary 5 times as me. How is that possible man? It is because I'm using AI tools and chat GPT to automate my work and I'm working 10 times as compared to you. That's why I'm getting paid 5 times as compared to you. That is super man. Can you please teach me the same so that I can grow my salary as well? Absolutely I can. So Google Chrome, our go-to web browser for just about everything, has decided that it's time to get an AI upgrade. This is not just about a new look or faster performance, it's about fundamentally changing how we interact with our browser. We are talking about making your online life easier, more organized and even a bit more fun. The first major update is the AI powered tab organizer. So if you are familiar with the endless sea of tabs that can flood your browser, this feature is a, this feature is a godsend one. Chrome now offers to neatly categorize these tabs into groups. This isn't just a simple sorting trick. It's a smart way to keep your digital workspace organized. For instance, if you are researching a topic, shopping online or just lining up on your daily news, Chrome reads it automatically and it will suggest tab groups. This feature aims to like make your browsing experience more streamlined and less cluttered with the added convenience of suggested names and emojis for each group. And moving on to personalization, Chrome's new aid driven theme creator is a delight for those who like to add personal touch to their browsing experience drawing on the success of Android's generative wallpaper. This feature allows users to craft a browser theme that reflects their mood, style or preferred color palette. It's a unique way of ensuring that your browser looks and feels just the way you want to put it. But perhaps the most intriguing addition is the writing assistant. This feature is designed to help users with their online writing task whether it's drafting a social media post writing an online review or composing an email this tool offers a ai generated suggestion to kickstart your writing process and it's a clever solution for those moments when you are stuck for words offering instances in crafting messages that are clear appropriate and on point these updates are a part of google's latest chrome release and are currently available in the us for mac and windows users while they are being still experimental in the other uh, countries and places and these represent a significant step forward in integrating AI into our everyday web browsing experience and behind the scene Google is using some sophisticated technology to power these futures. The theme creator for example employs a text to image diffusion model to transform user inputs to a visual themes. The writing assistant is akin to a scaled down version of Google's experimental AI search experience tailored to assist in various writing styles and tones. Google is clearly positioning Chrome not just as a tool for browsing but the web is an intelligent assistant to enhance productivity and personalization. And guys, if you want to enhance your productivity, I just want to have a small talk with you right now. Nowadays, you all might know that AI is taking over the world. And in just a short span of time, you have seen so many layoffs, millions of jobs replaced by AI and whatnot. And I believe that you don't want to get affected by this recession wave, right? Well, I can assure you that an AI won't replace you, but the person using AI will surely. So if you want to save your job and become irreplaceable in your career, join our 3 hour AI tools workshop in which we'll teach you about the best AI tools to upskill yourself, increase your productivity and also enhance your career. Make your future secure with us. Join our workshop by clicking the link below in the description now. So let's continue the video. While these AI features are currently experimental, this is a significant shift in how we will interact with our browsers in the future. Google vision is to make browsing not only more efficient but also more intuitive and aligned with the individual user needs. It's worth noting that Google is not alone in this race to smarten up web browser. Other players like Microsoft Edge and Oprah have been experimenting with AI integrations as well. This trend underscores a larger movements in the tech industries where AI is increasingly being used to enhance user experience and functionality in software applications. And in addition to these new features, Chrome already boasts a range of AI powered and machine learning tools. These include capabilities for captioning audio and video protecting 
against malicious site silencing permission prompts and summarizing web pages google plans to continue this trend integrating even more ai and machine learning features into chrome including the use of its new ai model gemini so what this all mean for the average chrome user in essence is that the browser is uh, so what this means for an average chrome user in essence is that the browser is evolving from a mere tool for accessing the internet to a more holistic intelligent assistant these new features aim to reduce the digital clutter we all face personalized this new feature aims to reduce the digital clutter that we all face on our personalized levels our browsing experience and assist in our online communication while there may be a learning curve and some initial kinks to iron out the potential for a more efficient personalized and intuitive browsing experience it is but this browsing experience is immense and these new tools although still in their experimental phase hint at a future where our web browser does more than just open page it understands and adapt to our needs for chrome user this marks the beginning of a new era where their browser is not just a tool but an ai friend in their digital journey while they explore or move around on the web browser and, and the way we interact with the web is poised to become more intuitive and aligned with our individual preferences so guys i hope you like the information given in the video and guys that is it for this video so if you like the video don't forget to leave a like and also drop a comment if you have any doubt and also don't forget to subscribe beat nx and do remember that we have an ai tools workshop which is just available for 9 rupees do check that out the link is in the description and i will see in the next video with some more new ai knowledge until then bye bye